Greetings, I am Mr. Sean. Welcome to my channel. I hope you all had a wonderful new year and end of your holiday season. Start off this new year, let's eat some comfort food to help us feel all warm and gooey inside. Especially for the poor souls in the Midwest, East, who are getting hit with the chills. This is the Warcraft Cookbook Review of Westfall Stew. Prepare two pounds of stew meat by tossing it with salt and pepper and allow it to sit at room temperature for at least 30 minutes on your counter. Preheat your oven to 475 degrees Fahrenheit into a 9x12 pan with tall sides in the oven. Drop in a half cup diced bacon and one tablespoon of butter. Allow that to cook for the next few minutes. We are waiting for the bacon fat to seep out where we will then slowly add one quarter cup of flour mixing it in until all the flour is absorbed. Also, drop your oven temperature from 475 down to 325 degrees. Next, whisk in four cups of beef broth and one cup of cranberry juice, substituting for red wine. And one teaspoon of northern spices. Add in six carrots that have been both peeled and cut down to bite-sized pieces. Add one head of garlic, which I forgot to get and used minced garlic, and bay leaves to the pan. Add one cup of pearl barley, Finally, add the stew meat, pouring water into the pan until it comes up to the meat, but do not cover it. When I looked into my pan, I believed I had enough water or liquid at that moment, so I did not add any. Cook for one and a half hours to two hours, then stir. If during this cooking time you need to add liquid, do so. Cook for another hour, stir. During this last hour, I tossed together one tablespoon of melted butter, one tablespoon of brown sugar, one and one quarter cup of pearl onions, and one pound of sliced button mushrooms. Oh no, I forgot them. Oh well. Add this mixture to a baking sheet and cook at 475 degrees for about 15 minutes or until the mushrooms start releasing their liquid and onions are slightly glazed. and add the remaining cranberry juice and the onions and mushrooms, stirring it in. Cook for another 30 minutes and remove from the oven. Remove bay leaves and serve in bowls. Sprinkle chopped fresh parsley for decoration. If you only have a single oven or can't fit a small baking sheet on the same rack as the bacon, I would recommend cooking the pearl onions and mushrooms before the bacon, then set it aside until the end. This recipe will take approximately 30 minutes to prep and about three and a half hours to cook, and will serve at least four people. Thank you very much for watching my video. Please leave a like, please leave a comment down below as to what you think about this video, think about the food that's being created, think about the food that's being reviewed, and please subscribe so you can get more recipes and more reviews coming down the pike for World of Warcraft and many more. Thank you for joining me. Ciao.